All right, I'm just going to show the little situation with the motors. DYS 1806 motor, and a Emacs 20 amp with BL Heli. And using that little guide, I can program the parameters. But I'm still having a little startup issue with the motor. When I give it like full throttle real quick, I'll just show it right now. Turn that on. Yeah, see it does that. And that's like 25% throttle. And see if I and then it comes alive sometimes. I go full throttle real quick, and then it might just, it'll actually like click real loud and it'll kick in. But sometimes it don't. There it goes. And then sometimes it feels fine. So you kind of like starts and it hesitates and it kicks in. And then it goes back to doing that sometimes. It's weird. I'm not too sure what's going on. Yeah, that was definitely weird, that one. But I will go into the parameters and kind of show what I can change. Like, I know that I can change the motor rotation, so I know like that little guide is somewhat accurate. I know it's not completely accurate because I want to say it's the start mode. The start mode, I don't know if it's focusing, but start mode actually has like four parameters. It'll do four beeps. So I'm not exactly too sure on what's, you know, it's not saying anything for the four beeps, so I don't know what it is. So, but I'll just do a little quick, I'll change the motor rotation on it just to show that it's, it's working and it's, I know it's one that I can get to and so it's spinning, it's spinning clockwise right now. So turn this off. Plug the battery. Turn that on. Throttle is at full throttle. Plug it in. And then here it's going two beeps is timing mode, three beeps, start mode, four beeps, cutoff mode, and then five is a long beep, and two long beeps, then a beep, then a beep, beep. <laughs> Next one is motor rotation. So I throttle stick down. There's one beep for normal rotation, two beeps for reverse. And I don't know what three beeps is. <laughs> so normal, reverse. Throttle stick up and down. And then it'll, conf it'll basically restart the ESC. And you see it's doing it goofy, but the motor's spinning counterclockwise now. So I think something is why it's starting like that must be either throttle curve, cutoff mode, start mode. I changed start mode. There's four different start modes but this little guide is only showing three. There's fast, soft, very soft. And I don't know what the fourth one is. I selected the fourth one, really made no difference. And then timing mode, I have brake type off. I had it on, it sounded like the motor was like jammed full of steel. <laughs> it was like screeching, so that doesn't need to be on. But I've tried different combinations with timing, start, cutoff mode, throttle curve, so I don't know what, it'd be nice to know what the factory settings were 
and I could just put it back to that. <laughs> but for now, I'm just basically playing a pretty much guess and check, trial and error. But for anyone that maybe needs to know that, if you go to Emacs's website and you can download the the guide that'll tell you the parameters for the the ESCs and you can change them with your transmitter but it's for I guess this ESC is a little new so it might be a little different especially with VL Heli I'm guessing this one was actually for Simon K models so obviously something's different I don't know if I need to get a, a USB linker and try and program it that way or program it in BL Heli Suite or Suit or however you say it. I'm I'm completely new to that kind of stuff. I basically just build stuff, put it together and fly it. <laughs> but it'd be nice to know what's going on or else if I can't get this ESC to work, I'm just gonna go buy a new one.